Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Now we will try to solve the following OD gy dx is equal to x minus y by x plus y. Now note that this, this function is a homogeneous function. How we know this is homogeneous? Because in the numerator, this term has degree 1, this term has degree 1. So uh, the degree of the numerator is degree 1. In the denominator also, x has degree 1, y has degree 1. So degree of x plus y is degree 1. So uh, the degree of the book of x minus y by x plus y is 1 minus 1 is 0. So this is a degree uh, 0 homogeneous function. So we will solve it by letting y equal to dx. So then we get dy dx is equal to p plus x dt dx. The derivative of dx is d plus x dt dx. So if we substitute this into the differential equation, we get d plus x dv dx is equal to x minus dx by x plus dx. So by cancelling x out from the numerator and denominator, we get 1 minus d by 1 plus b. So we have x dv dv dx is equal to 1 minus d by 1 plus b minus b. So if we determine this, we get 1 minus b minus b minus d square. So we have 1 minus 2b minus d square by 1 plus b. So here we get the separable of d. So we, we will separate the d and x. So we have 1 plus b by 1 minus 2b minus d square dv is equal to dx by x. So by integrating we get this. Now let 1 minus 2b minus d square is equal to p. So we have minus 2 minus 2b dv equal to dp. So note that it is minus 2 times 1 plus b dv equal to dp. So we have 1 plus b dv is minus dp by 2. So here we get uh, 1 plus b gv is minus dp by 2 and 1 minus 2b minus d square is p is equal to and integral dx by x is integral log x plus c. So here we have a minus half log p is equal to log x and for the simplification we take this constant as c as log c prime. So we have basically if we multiply by 2 uh, we have minus log p minus 2 log x sorry plus 2 log x plus 2 log c C prime. So we have here P inverse is equal to x square C prime. Now what is P? P is 1 minus 2B minus E square is equal to x square C prime or C prime square actually. And what is B? 1 minus 2Y by X plus 2 by X square will is c prime square x square. So this is the general solution of the given value. 